In this video, we will show you how to easily integrate RS Form Pro with MailChimp using the RS Form Pro MailChimp plugin. To download the plugin from our website, go to the Downloads section and click on Modules and Plugins next to RS Form Pro. Click on Plugins and look for the MailChimp plugin. Click on the download button next to it and save the archive to your computer. To install the plugin, log into your administrator section and head to Extensions, Manage, Install. Click on Choose File and browse to the location of the file you've just downloaded. Click on Upload and Install, wait a few seconds, and the plugin should be installed. A confirmation message will appear. The plugin needs to be enabled for the integration to work. Let's make sure it is. Go to Extensions, Plugins, and click to enable the RS Form Pro MailChimp plugin. The next step consists in configuring the MailChimp side of the integration. Let's go to the MailChimp Account Extras and click on API Keys. If you do not already have an API key, click on Create a Key. In this video, we have used a key that was previously generated. Copy that key. You will need to paste it into the RS Form Pro configuration area. In the back end, we have to select Components, RS Form Pro, Configuration. Let's click on the MailChimp tab and paste the API key in the checkbox. In this example, we will use a list that was previously created. If you do not have a list, you have to create one. As you can notice in our list, there are already six subscribers. Let's edit the list. To do this, go to Manage Subscribers and click on Groups. As an example, we choose the radio buttons to show the group options in our sign-up form. For an easier understanding, we have created the same three groups suggested by MailChimp. Donating, Volunteering, and Events. These groups will be displayed as a radio group in the MailChimp list. Later on, we will be mapping them to an RS Form Pro radio group as well. You will also need to create a custom RS Form Pro form that contains all of the fields necessary for the integration. The charity radio group we have mentioned earlier will be mapped with its MailChimp list homolog. The same goes for the action radio group, which allows the user to choose whether to subscribe or unsubscribe to the list. The email, first name, and last name fields are added by default but can be removed in any new MailChimp list. They need to be added to the integration form as well. Now let's set up the integration by clicking on Form Properties and selecting the MailChimp integration. Setting Use MailChimp Integration to Yes will enable the integration for this particular form. 
If you wish to let the user decide whether to subscribe or unsubscribe to the list, you will need to map the MailChimp action field with the custom RS form pro field that contains the subscribe and unsubscribe values. Select the MailChimp list in the list ID field. Then, associate the user information fields accordingly. Lastly, map the charity field which controls in which group the subscriber will be added. Let's save our work and go to the front end. To test the integration, simply submit the form and check the subscription in the MailChimp list. Congratulations, you have successfully added the new subscriber to the MailChimp list.